So guys, you want to head over to search and then type in printers and scanners. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to find your printer. You want to click on it. And then you want to click on open queue. Now once you're on this, you want to click on the printer tab. And then you want to click on cancel all documents. Now once you click on cancel all documents, another box will appear. You want to click on yes. Now for the second step, you want to head over to search again and type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. And now once you're on this, we're going to type in NET space stop space spooler and click on enter. Now once you've done that, you want to copy and paste the command which I'll leave down below in the description. Just copy this, head back into CMD and then click on Control V on your keyboard, which will then paste it here and then click on enter. And now for the last step, you want to head over to search and type in services. Click on it. And now once you're on this, you want to click on any service, then click on P on your keyboard. Then we're going to scroll down and then find print spooler. Here it is, you want to double click on it. And you want to make sure the startup type says automatic and then you want to click on start which will then make the service status running and then click on ok. Now you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.